A thought just hit me. I am terrified to make these videos. Every week I work to come up with the messages I wanna say. I think through how I wanna say it, the stories that I wanna share, the lessons that I wanna teach. And I try to craft it in a way where I'm not just rambling over and over again. And then I look at my schedule and I think about all the things that I have to do, the really important things. And it comes time to record these videos and I always push it off. And so this morning I got up really, really early, worked on the four messages that I wanna share and just planned it out in my head. And right now is the time that I should be recording these videos and something stopped me. Deep down inside I thought, well, can I do it later? I have other things I should be doing. Do I really need to record these videos right now? Is it really that important? Surely there's other things I should be focusing on. And it hit me, I realized that I am scared or something. I'm, I'm worried, I'm scared, I'm terrified. Why don't I wanna do this? Am I worried it won't be good enough? Am I worried that my location isn't great or that the sun isn't great or that I won't sound good or look good or I'll ramble on? Am I worried that, you know, when it's in my head or it's on paper, it's ideas, it's perfect, but when I say it out loud, it won't be good enough? That I won't live up to my expectations? That I won't be extraordinary? That I'm gonna make a mistake? What am I so afraid of? I know that I'm not alone in this because you and I both know the things that we should do and yet we don't. You and I both know the things that we shouldn't be wasting our time on and yet we waste our time on them. We find ourselves day after day after day, you and me, week after week after week, month after month, we just waste so much time because we're afraid of doing the things that we have to do. We're afraid so we don't do them. We make excuses. We know, we, we, don't, we just don't do them. So Wednesdays are my day to film. I was so busy yesterday, I just pushed it off. Thursday morning, this morning I get up, I plan my messages, I have my coffee, I listen to my music, I feel bold, I feel ready. And yet the moment comes in my schedule where it's time to film and I stop and I don't want to do it. I don't want to do this. It's just not going to be good enough I get. And I almost put it off. I almost didn't start recording. And then I realized, what is going on? Why every week, why every week when it comes time to record, do I not record? Why is it that when I had Steve on my team, a full-time salaried employee, every time he'd come to my door and knock on my door with a camera and say, Mark, it's time to record. And I'd have this just this like feeling and I'm just like, can, dude, can we do this later? Can we do this another time? Can you make it easier for me? Is there anything you can do? It must be a scheduling issue. I must be too busy. There must be like excuse after excuse after excuse. I wanted everybody to make everything easier for me. But at the end of the day, it has to be. There's no other reason for it other than I'm just, I don't like it because I'm afraid of it. Someone left a comment on one of my videos on YouTube and they said, you know, I used to run so quick. I used to attack everything. I used to be on everything. And right now I feel like I'm a turtle. I, I'm, I'm not motivated. I'm super slow and I don't know what to do about it. And my response to them was super clear, right? There's only three reasons why you don't do the things that you're supposed to do. One, you simply do not like it. You hate it. So you're not going to do it. Two, it's not important enough for you, so you don't see any reason to do it. Or three, this is the big one, you're afraid of it. You're afraid you won't do it well. You're afraid you won't live up to your expectations. You're afraid you're gonna make a mistake. You're afraid you're gonna look foolish or be judged. You're just afraid. And so when I'm thinking about, hey Mark, why won't you record your videos? Why won't you do the things that Josh on your team is waiting for you to do. And why won't you just step up and do the thing that you know that you want to do and should do and need to do? Why won't you do it? I have to ask myself, do I really hate this? No, I actually like it when I get going. I actually like doing this and I wanna get better at it and I wanna practice. So it's not that. Do I not want it bad enough? Maybe, but I don't think that's it because deep down, I know that crushing doubt and crushing fear and helping others build something that they're proud of just fires me up. And it's something that I love doing and it's something that I wanna be a part of. I love building extraordinary things. And that includes giving people the hope and the belief that they in turn can do it. I love it. I live for it. So it can't be that. 
So it must be the third thing. I just must be afraid that uh, I won't do a good job, that I'll embarrass myself. I guess I'm just afraid that, you know, I have such high expectations and such high hopes that I won't do it, that I won't be clear, that I won't be vulnerable, that I'm going to ramble, that no one will pay attention, that it doesn't really matter, that while I'm busy doing this, I should be busy doing something else. And so I don't do it. And that actually just embarrasses me because it's so not extraordinary. It's so mediocre to allow the fear of not being good enough to stop me from making a video, something that I know I can do, something that I love doing, something that I need more practice on. It's just so, well, it's not me. But here's the lesson for you and for me. Mark, watch this back. If you are not doing the things that you need to do consistently, you either don't like it, you either don't want it bad enough, or you're just afraid. And if you don't want it, then stop doing those things. If you don't want it bad enough, tie it in to your purpose or stop doing those things. And then the last thing is if you're just afraid, you know the answer, right? You just gotta do it anyway. You just gotta do it anyway. Now, if you're still with me and you're saying, amen, brother, keep bringing it. Check out this video right there. I think you'd actually like it a lot and I will see you over there.